Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I am here with my early 2015 MacBook Pro 13 inch Retina model. And I've had the issue with the keyboard and trackpad not working on this MacBook Pro. What I'm going to show you today is how not to repair this MacBook Pro. Now originally I took this MacBook Pro into the local Apple store and they told me this MacBook Pro would require a new keyboard to solve the problem at a cost of $400. But when I Googled it, I saw uh, many people commenting online that this ribbon cable is actually what is at fault when you get this keyboard and trackpad failure with this MacBook Pro 13 inch retina model. So what I did was I opened it up and I uh, found that the end socket um, was actually slightly loose. And the first time I just was able to click it down reseat the connector and the MacBook Pro worked for about a week. A second time I did it, I opened it up, it failed, I opened it up and I actually put um, some uh, post-it note to pack that connector down. Now it was successful for a couple of weeks but I say it's a failure because it failed again. So there you go folks, that's how not to repair your early 2015 MacBook Pro 13 inch Retina that has that keyboard and trackpad issue. Now in the future, I'm going to post a video on how to do the repair properly, where you actually replace that little ribbon cable in the MacBook Pro. If that's something you wanna do, do feel free to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit that bell notification for that update when it comes along. Until then, have a good evening.